Hi there, welcome back to another video, and in this one we're going to talk about why Saw was a good choice for the final DLC character, as well as a DLC character in general. So as you know, Saw Upon Kingdom Hearts was added, in case you didn't, sorry. And there are definitely lots of people who are happy, because I think so. But some people might not be. So which is why I wanted to make this one. Make this video. Okay, one. Um, he was the most requested character. And people like it when people like, say, King K. Wall and stuff got added because lots of people wanted him. I'm saying that because this YouTuber thought he was the most requested character. But no, it was Sora. I think that alone might be a reason enough. Although some people might not think that. Maybe you don't like Kingdom Hearts. So of course I got more. For one, um... For me at least. Uh, this entire pass, we... I've, I think, I think this entire pass has taught us that, um, there is not one character who can't be added. So yeah, um, so for sure got added, you know, we got, of course we got characters like, say, Minecraft Steve and Sephiroth. Which, you know, characters people didn't think had chances against Smash, and yet, here they are. And, there's enough title that kind of has this, but, um, which is Kazuya. And I know what you're thinking, um, some people said that Kazuya seemed like the perfect Smash character to get in, like, like for attacking lap, he seemed like the perfect one to get in. But what I'm saying is that pe lots of people thought that if we got Tekken lap, we'd get Hitachi. Granted, before Kazuya got the field, they didn't really know much about Tekken. So obviously, wasn't in the boat of, oh, if we get one, it'll be Hitachi, and since we got the Miha costume. We all get Tekken left. I was in that boat all the just because we got the Heihachi one means we could still be get that we could get an actual Tekken lap. Which you know did come true, but of course I was in that boat. And of course Sora's a surprising character because he was also a character I didn't really think had chances. I think that kind of changed with the whole, the whole, um, Sora music leak that just came out. Many we really think that Sora does have a chance of getting in. It did. Granted, leading up to it, I guess I was so nervous about that, and the tweet and stuff, that, I guess, I guess I forgot about it. Forgot about the whole leak. Which, of course, is why I had my reaction to Sora, which you can go check out the, I did one for his reveal and his full reveal, which I just uploaded, but I'm also going to make another video before that, but, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm about to end the video. I just want to, I have one more reason to now end the video, but, of, of why Sora Resolved to be the last final. And my final reason is that it broke a wall. It's like what Cloud said his reveal trailer, which is kind of relevant. Walls are meant to be broken, and lots and lots of walls have been broken. There's one guy made a whole video about it. I don't want to make this video too long, but. A famous rule was that we couldn't get two characters from the same company in Fire Pass. In the Fire Pass, you know, we got 
Uh, we got one Psycho Ep in Top S1 being Joker. We got one Trinix Ep in Top S1 being Hilo. One Microsoft being Banjo Kazooie. One SNK being Terry. And of course, you know, got Byla. And well, yeah, you can probably make the argument that us getting, um, uh, us getting, um, Min Min and Pond Rift for a complex in wall. Although, you know, something we don't forget about is that the Fiber Pass, uh, is chosen by Nintendo. They basically give Sakurai a list of characters, and he, and he picks them. Although sometimes in meetings, um, ask him if they can put a son final in. That's basically how the Wash store was selected. Was selected, you know. If you know, but still. Um, so with uh, Sora, you know. I've got. Oh yeah, I forgot what well, my point was for a second, but. So what sort of might not have a big impact to you who probably saw Min Min and Pyra and Nipra who sure can maybe say we got three characters but since they're the same slots it's kind of like we got two uh, not two not two different characters but like two Nintendo characters and um so you might think that's what kind of broke this wall, but well, like I said, since Nintendo's picking the finals, it's um I guess it, in a way makes sense. I think lots of people thought it was weird that we didn't before we got by people thought it was weird we didn't get an Nintendo character on top as one. Not like including um Wild Plant, which if you do makes two Nintendo characters. I saw people like talking about that before the whole saw thing we took off. And they kinda of did have a good pattern on. Which made me think Dr. Eggman. Which you know I am kinda of sad like didn't get in. Honestly we really wanted him just because I liked Sonic and just wanted a new final, but he definitely would have been cool. Next Smash game. If we do get in that next Smash game I'll I think I would rather have Tails. Granted, I don't know how unique you'd be, but yeah. I also might make a video about Fireballs, I think, could be in the next one, but I'll do that made later. So stay tuned and always be a seatbelt in the driving a vehicle. Bye bye.